Yeah, let me see LLC fight. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, okay, I don't know why. I don't know why. Do you know why? Good children. Good children. Good mister. Good fantasy. Good fruit. Good fruit. Good fantasy. So guys, thank you so much. Welcome to Abatai Primary School here in Agrigiroi uh, sub-county. Just like we are telling you, today we are monitoring the schools of Agrigiroi that they have gotten the trees from Teso Youth Network. And today we are here in Abata, and I think Abatai might become the best school. Just watch and see uh, what is happening here. We are trying to bring Teso and we are with LOC5 of Mora district for Dongo last year. So guys some banana suckers. Now this is what we recommend. Yes. Mm. Only that Mamune <laughs> City This thing I'm mm. going Only that we just want them. I took some aboron who born without using it because now we may have a area with land all the way. So, how do we aboron with your cocoa? You think so? So there are innovations that we want. So this is cool. So our uh, environment. This is full land. You can't do that. 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 You so that's the biggest challenge. Yeah. 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 So that's the challenge. You see, in the neighbors, you look like a case of kine. In a case of kine, it's a little bit of a problem. But kine, like that, kine, but to buy kine, when you make kine, you get to it. You know, you're ready to buy kine. We see challenges like this, you know, we're ready to buy kine. So we need that engagement with the community. So this is the challenge. Now you see the problem. This from here, that means the persons using this garden were not interested in trees. I know they were able to what? To destroy the trees. Which was really very disappointing. And you know, it disappointed even the kids, the, the, the people who were raising one. How, how much land are they looking at? How much land are they looking at? We are almost reaching the end. Why this work is good? A joke on our eye. A one unit, it the the program that has been going on mm. is not just a joke. Mm. So Etumana Le Korea Misirina is a responsible person. Mm. Yeah, At one least one. I have yeah. seen Ikito that are almost making a year a mm. name. Mm. So this is uh, what motivated us mm. to start rewarding, no? Mm. Mm. Guys, we are showing you the owner of this tree. Remember, these trees are owned by llamas. And here is the owner. He's called Melda. Team Melda. I think you're in this. This is. Wow. 
Por favor, ni te lo doy ahí, el loco, ni te lo doy ahí. Uh-huh. This is a team meal. I understand last week she was rewarded a piglet, eh? Yes. And how is the piglet being? It is really good. Do you feed it? What do you give it? Cassava. Do you know this? This was not rewarded. You know, you know. How old is this? Ekorofot. Eat ekorofot. Is it now here? Even a queen will talk. So, Shama. Yes. Me yenge se edangi to sa misiri nebo. Besa me. Besa me. Ya kusa me bongo loto. So na, lo na. So about the primary school guys is having six garden here. Six acres. This is land. Innovation. Wow. This guy was rewarded the pig. Yeah. Who is the owner? What is it? Hello, hello. Hello, Nicky. Hello, Nicky. Hello, Nicky. Hello, Nicky. Good boy. Which class? Primary. Primary four. Hey, so what inspired you to do this? So the young man is saying he weeds it and adds local manure. Let's give him a hand clap. Chicken droppings, even the goat's... What is it? It's also dropping. He droppings, eh? He adds it slowly, slowly. Yes. So, so you can see the, the tree is looking good. Eh? Mm. It was also rewarded with a piglet. Okay. Ah, you are keeping the piglet very well? Yes. So guys, this one shows you that our learners here in Teso, mostly in rural areas, now know the manures they used to put to their gardens. I think this is a very good initiative. Yes. Because now they are able to know the types of manures they use for planting trees and other, other crops. Yeah? Oh. Again, eh? This girl Guinea? was rewarded a piglet. Wow. Hey. Wow. <laughs> a peduru. <laughs> what is a peduru in English? <laughs> what is a, a peduru in English? <laughs> what is it? Tamarind tree. Tamarind tree. Wow. Very delicious for cooking, eh? At top, eh? Yeah. Ah. Oh, porridge. Yeah. Huh? So that girl was also rewarded. What is your name? I say Kenya, Agnes. You can see, you can even see the droppings of goats. So she has really manured her her tree. Now there is an inspirational tree. There is a girl who just came and checked on her tree, and we just felt inspired. That's the tree we are almost reaching. So guys, I believe this is what other schools need to do here in Teso. Today we are here with uh, TINET, that is uh, an organization, Teso Youth Network here in Teso, trying to bring Teso to literally Teso again. And the leader is here, uh, Okelo Etefen, is the brain behind these projects here. And today we are moving around schools, and we have gotten a school, I think, so far. For all schools that we have reached, I think about I can take to be one of the on this one, and then as Let's we check this check please. No one I know. We're supposed to be rewarded as a piglet. Where's wow. Olubot? But uh, we are going to reward him anyway. Wow. Irrigation wow. scheme is there. Innovation, eh? Wow. <laughs> Drip irrigation. Uh -huh. Oh my god. Yeah, so he puts water. And then the tamarind tree is very, very excited inside. Very it is nice. growing very nicely. Wow, wow. And you know what the good news? I'm happy that this school has initiated the planting of tamarind trees. Because the tamarind that we eat in Teso sub-region comes from Congo mm. and West Nile. Mm. And yet these trees can grow very well in Teso sub-region. So we encourage parents, everybody to plant tamarind trees. 
Thank you. Bye. Remember, guys, if you don't have tamarind, you'll never enjoy kalo very well here in Teso. And if you want to enjoy that chicken of yours, you need a tamarind. Wow. Yes. This is the number one wow, 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 person. Wow. I think we need to clap this for tamarind. this. Yeah. <laughs> Tamarind is not one year old, less than one year old, which will make one year in uh, September. I think it's Akol. I think it's Akol. What's your full name? Akol Susan. You can see that this daughter of mine is doing very well. And the tamarind tree is growing steadily. Yeah? They were Thank planted you. together with the other one. All of them. Wow. All of let's them. let's know from them. her. Hey. Mm. 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 No, yeah, they don't in Kutuna. Director, yes. she doesn't have a, a tamarind tree at home. So we must give to her another tamarind tree to plant. The jai jai tamarind tree. Go with jackfruit. The penesi. The jai. Good penesi. <laughs> Good fruit. Good fruit. In fact, this program, this program gave uh, households here trees. Uh, over 100 households received uh, a minimum of 10 trees. Mm. Uh, so, I think Steve, you need to explain to our viewers there. Uh, yeah. So, new ring now, when you know? I'm going to go to the house. You see? You're going to go to the You see? So, uh, ladies and gentlemen, dear viewers, uh, this is Etafen Okello. Uh, ED, Teso Youth Network, a community-based organization based here in Ngora, which is uh, retreating Ngora district. And today we are here uh, in Abatai Primary School together with uh, Jokea team and most importantly uh, with uh, our LO chairperson LOC5. We are inspecting trees and seeing what these young people are doing in order to make sure that these trees survive. Uh, we are standing with uh, one of the people here by the name of Akol, Susan, and uh, we are inspired by her tree, the tamarind tree, which is growing, I, I, I could say abnormally, because we have checked all <laughs> other trees, mm. they are still down. but they are still down. <laughs> this is the tamarind that people assume does not what? Grow very grow fast. Very fast. Mm. But as you can see, we planted this last year in September. This is July and you can see how the tree is. And uh, we have been asking her, how has she been able to make it uh, this? How has she been able to hit this success? She's saying she has been applying, first of all, protecting it and then applying manure, uh, natural manure. And uh, she's saying she decomposes the manure for one week. I think she said one week. Yeah. And then gets it and uh, keeps putting it here regular, on regular basis. This is really good and uh, it inspires me. It inspires other learners who are here that also have trees. And probably their trees have not reached this extent. It really inspires them. I am happy and very motivated that the LOC5 is here to talk to these young people so that from a leader to them, they can feel inspired and work harder and better than they have been doing. So I must really appreciate this. I also want to appreciate uh, the Jokea TV for all your services in documenting what we are doing. Because uh, teacher, we have gone to very many schools that uh, we gave the trades, yes, but most yes, of yes. them have not managed the way you've managed. Yes, How have yes. you convinced these learners? These learners always, you talk to them, you advise them always, and give them the advantages of trees. Because in, most of them, they eat those trees during lunch hours. We don't have, we don't have midday meals at school. Parents have failed to get midday meals at school. Now, we have encouraged them that as we eat the trees, why can't we plant more yes. mm, so that we enjoy in the future? That's why. 
they any interested in, in planting this. Now what is your advice to head teachers outside there? I advise all the head teachers to encourage their children also to do the same like Abakai Primary School is doing. Mm. Uh, I do it, I do it, uh, this program in conjunction with the senior man teacher who is in charge of the environment. Wow. Mm. So guys, with us. let's hear from the environment himself. He's the environment teacher and I think uh, when we're seeing him moving, everyone was following him because he's, he's in charge of the environment. Thank you so much. Yes. You're welcome to your care services. We really need to know from you how you manage this project here and some challenges you have. Uh, let me start with the challenge. Yes. The most serious one is the people who normally come and grass their animals at the school here. So these animals normally come and in this place. Thinking of, you, have, you have even seen some of the trees have died because they come and grass their animals here. Then, uh, maybe what I can say, how we have managed this, it is the support from the stakeholders yes. that gave us support. That's why we are able to make it like that. Thank you so much. I, you know we are moving with the chairperson, the district chairperson of Ngora a district and I know we have gone to very many schools and he's very excited. <laughs> from the time we came here he's very happy. I want him to say something what he has, has seen from Abatai Primary School. Welcome. Thank you Julius. I'm absolutely very excited. This is the number one school in tree planting in the entire district. Wow. To, to from me. Good fruit. fruit. <laughs> and some of my kiddos, eh? uh, I will deliver them to this okay. school as a gift to my children. It is very exciting to see young learners planting trees and taking care of them. Mm. Our future will be better if we adopted tree planting. Mm -hmm. Because tree planting goes hand in hand with food security. I would call this is a Semeika Kungulu tree planting spirit that has been started, regenerated, reborn by the youth. And I want to thank the director, uh, Tynet, for a good job well done, and your team, and Julius for the, the documentary. The management of the school. It so doesn't do any summer. If you bring manure, it will remain for your tree, for our tree. Our tree, our future. Thank you. Wow. I wish if all learners outside there who, are, who get this opportunity to get trees can do this. Let's copy from Abata. When I say Abata, you, you say, say trees. trees. Abata, trees. Abata, trees. 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 When I say Tainet, you say trees. Tainet, trees. Tainet, trees. trees. When I say Penesi, you say trees. Epenesi, trees. Epenesi, trees. When I say Jokea, you say trees. Jokea, trees. Jokea, trees. When I say Odongo, you say trees. Odongo, trees. Odongo, trees. Thank you. Oh, guys, that is the way to go to Green Africa again. Thank you so much, guys, for watching. We are still moving around Abatai. Abatai has planted a lot of trees, and I think this is what everybody should copy. Let's copy from what they have done, because so far this is the best school, as the chairperson has said. Thank you, guys. We are moving around. Stick with us. We are still moving, guys. You need to pick something from uh, Abatai. <laughs> and then if we are one, the best one can select them from those schools, the best institution to select them and put them into the annual retreat test or annual awards. Mm. But also, we are organizing next month the Petra Bala Tomonari. We want to organize for Policy Advocacy Forum, where we come together with all stakeholders and we discuss tree planting and how we can sustain it here in our district. Yeah. So, I can say 100% commitment to support you and the initiative. Yeah. Anything to do with the tree planting, I'm available mm -hmm. 24 Thank hours. Thank you. Because issues of climate change are the order of the day. Yeah. We need to 
preserve, rejuvenate our environment if we have to survive. So, Erotoli Toronto is a boundary. Mm. Mm. Where is the base of the boundary? Mm.